No big need for those jackets today, but we do still have a cold front in the forecast. We'll get to that here in just a moment. Looking at the satellite and radar here as we go into the afternoon, a lot of sunshine out there for us for now, but those grays and the lighter shades, those are clouds that are moving our way. And we'll see the clouds increase as we head into the afternoon and evening hours. So enjoy that sunshine. Wind coming in here from the southwest uh, on average about 10 miles an hour, bringing in that warmth as well across the low country and the coastal empire. Warming us up warmer than where we were yesterday. Many of us by at least 10 degrees. Monday was a little on the cool side, but outside right now, lots of sunshine over the Plant Riverside District, and it is a nice day. Those temperatures already seeing some 70s pop up. Looking at you guys over in Richmond Hill, over in Vidalia, Jessup as well. We're going to see more 70s as we head into the afternoon, but clouds increasing as well as we get into the next, let's say, few hours. By 4 o'clock, you'll notice some more clouds around. That wind not going to change too much, though. Holding steady, though, out of the southwest. And the rain chance still going to be low through 6 o'clock. It's thereafter where we introduce a slight chance of rain that comes on into the forecast. But notice this, too. Not only do we have some clouds, a slight rain chance, but the temperatures really not dropping too much here as we go through the evening hours. That's really going to set us up for a warm tomorrow morning in the 50s. But let's talk about today first. Starting this at 5 o'clock, notice a few little isolated showers along north of I-16, perhaps getting over towards Swainsboro, Sylvania. Stopping this future radar now at 8 o'clock. We're dry on the coast and in Savannah, but some of our inland areas, especially along the north of I-16, could get in on some of these showers, which will continue to progress toward the low country and the Savannah River as we head through the evening. By 11 to midnight, maybe a stray shower coming into Bluffton, Hilton Head toward uh, Savannah, Rinkin, perhaps Richmond Hill. But the further north you live, the better your chance is of a light shower here tonight. And we see those disappear with a few clouds around on our Wednesday morning at daybreak. Check this out. Temperature in Savannah going to be 58 degrees. Our average high this time of the year, 61. So starting the day off very warm on our Wednesday and there you have it. Pick out your town pretty evenly spaced out here. We've got those upper 50s. It's going to be a warm one and those low temperatures continue to stay above average for the next week. Even after the cold front comes in, we see temperatures only go down to the low to mid 40s on Saturday before warming up again going into next week. Some rain thrown in the mix here as well over the next handful of days and we'll talk about it right after this quick break.